but it's here in Bristol where it all begins, at the Clifton Suspension Bridge. This is the site of the first bungee jump, 250 foot above high water. In the warehouse, Simon Keeling was sound asleep on a pile of ropes. The party was a great success and we all had way too much fun and as a result no one showed up at dawn. It took us until about 10 or 11 to get organized and get our ropes. To I don't think that anybody really took it that seriously. And actually it wasn't that dangerous. To come back simply because we just had to get on with things before traffic built up and that was it. And I remember thinking very distinctly. I got back from London to find to my disbelief my fellow club members presumably For the party, I thought I'd probably collapse back onto the pavement. And I put a, a scarf around my face because I sure didn't want my mother to recognize me at the next morning's daily paper. Simon and Alan, being prudent engineers, waited to see what would happen to me. So at that point, Simon and I jumped off simultaneously. It was a very odd feeling because it felt like jumping over a fence. gate, except that there was nothing underneath, nothing, so it was like a very, very, very soft feeling, and, and then I'm um, sort of plunging down. I remember, at first, terrible fear letting go of the bridge after that. The irony was that Valentine Guinness had always said he had a dream and the fourth man was going to wipe out. So there was poor old Timo. Um, It was just such a wonderful feeling, you know. It's when you go off a bridge or something. No one has actually been hanging in the air where you've been. That's the fun of it, you know, it's unique. Sensations crowding in. You think, that bridge up there, nobody's ever seen the bridge from this point of view. For some reason, the bridge was suddenly shut. I always knew the police would arrive when... The police eventually show up and immediately enter into the spirit of the occasion. Unfortunately, the long arm of the law isn't long enough, so the intrepid jumpers are pulled in for questioning by volunteers. Worth getting arrested for. I do appreciate that it's necessary to no, attend no, no, no. mundane things like magistrate's court. Right. Well, I'm sorry, your brother. There we go. The police, I guess, didn't really know quite how to handle it. You just tell me what's going on here. No, not for a man. But they were, they were, they were perfectly friendly. Was it worth getting arrested for? Hey? Well, was it worth getting arrested? I think so. <laughs> How do you feel after fun? this escapade? It's very exhilarating. It's what a tremendous the, feeling. What was the idea behind? I don't know, it's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> we were all put in the, in the car and we were taken down to Bristol.
after you've jumped, you are just so pleased and happy with the world. I personally was just resigned in the back seat.